Hello students, welcome to Solar Cells classes. In this video, I will be solving some of the multiple selection questions from um, Jam 2017 on geology. So, the first question is that choose the landform or landforms that are resulted from glacial erosion. Now, now this glaciers glaciers they are a huge block of ice they are a huge block of ice that move along the landscape carving a distinct features along the way now the glacial erosion it occurs in two processes the first process is plucking plucking and the next process is abrasion abrasion now in plucking what happens is that when the glacier it moves over the landscape when glacier when glacier it moves so when a glacier moves over a landscape landscape the water melts below the glacier so it the water melts below the glacier and seeps into the cracks within the underlying bedrocks so this water seeps into the cracks underlying underlying uh, cracks within the underlying bedrocks cracks within the underlying bedrocks now this water freezes and melts and weakens the bond holding the piece of bedrocks in place so this water this water it freezes and melts weakening the bonds holding the pieces of bedrock in place bonds holding the pieces of bedrock in place bedrock in place and as a result of these weakening these pieces of rocks can now be picked up or plucked from their rocky ways and carried along the moving glacier so because of these weakening the rock pieces rock pieces can now be now be carried along with the moving glacier carried along with the moving glacier moving glacier and the next is abrasion now in abrasion erosion occurs erosion occurs when the particles particles they scrap against each other against each other so glacier is a huge block of ice that moves along the landscape carving distinct features along the way and glacier erosion is this carving technique which is done in two ways first is plucking in which the water melts below the glacier and seeps into the cr crack within the underlying 
wet rocks and this water it freezes and melts and thereby weakening the bonds holding the pieces of bedrock together in one place and when this bond is getting weakened this rock pieces can now be carried along along with the moving glaciers whereas abrasion it occurs in this erosion occurs when the particles they scrap against each other now among the following field is a long narrow inlet of steep sides that is created by glacial erosion so fjord is one of the landforms resulted from glacial erosion and the next one is circus which is also formed by the glacial erosion now here fjords it is a long narrow inlet so it is a wrong narrow inlet with steep sides or cliff with steep sides or cliffs and circle it is the amphitheater like valley it is an amphi theater it is an amphitheater like valley amphitheater like valley that is for also formed by glacial erosion so here the correct answer is option number a and option number d now in the next question we have to choose the correct combination of the types of dentition in bivalvia and the corresponding representative genus now the first is taxodont in taxodont the teeth are numerous and are arranged along a straight or curved hinge so here the teeth teeth are numerous and are arranged in that is and are arranged in a straight or curved hinge so taxodont are the teeth in the taxodont dentition the teeth are numerous and are arranged in straight or curved hinge the examples are arca barbatia the examples are arca barbatia nucula etc so the first combination is correct now next is isodont in isodonts the teeth are very large and lie on either sides of a central ligament piece so here so here the teeth are very large and lie on either side of a central ligament pit central ligament pit example of such dentition is on spondylus so the second combination is also correct next is pachydont in pachydont the teeth are very large heavy and blunt so here the teeth are very large heavy and blunt now some of the examples are hipporites so the third combination is also correct and the fourth one is 
desmodont in which the teeth are small and simple. Here the teeth are small and simple. Mea is example of one of those that have this type of dentition. So the fourth combination is also correct. So in question 32, all four options are correct.